Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I went ahead and filmed a quick eye tutorial, eyeshadow tutorial using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance palette, which is everything. But um, I wanted to do something simple and glam, but it didn't go that way. I sort of kind of got carried away, but uh, it is pretty simple. And I hope if there's a like it. Any questions you got, leave a comment down below. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good jazz. And I'm just gonna get straight to the tutorial because I don't have no Alright, so I'm gonna be else. using the Modern Renaissance palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I already primed my eye with um, MAC Paint Pot and Safa ochre and um i went ahead and just for a base to make the shadow blend better i used i ain't even gonna try to pronounce any of these colors because i don't know how so i'm gonna just point so i used that color right there to um just put all over my lid and then this color right here i just put it under my brow bone to start off with so i'm going to Go ahead take, and take um, my Morphe E22 brush, which is just a fluffy blending brush. And I am going to start with, oh yeah, I went ahead and did one, I thought it would be quicker. So I'm going to go ahead and start with um, this color right here. Just going to tap it in, dust it up, and I am just going to blend it into the crease of my eye all right so I want it to be rounded off so I'm just starting from the inner corner I like to go in circular motions and then do like a rainbow back and forth or a windshield wiper then I'm gonna take this um, burnt orange color right here and I'm going to do the same exact thing just go on top of that color with it Then I'm gonna use my um, new, it's like a pencil brush. It's by Mikasa. And it's the E310. Um, and I'm going to dip it in this orange, orangey, brownish orange looking color right here. Want tap it so in. I'm just gonna it. line my um, eye socket. Or the crease of my eye is what I'm trying to say. And I'm doing most of the product on the outside. And then whatever's left on the brush, I'll lightly do a little in the inside. Because I want it to mainly be focused on the inner corner. If you know what I'm writing. Okay, so once I sort of kind of get the shape how I want it, then I'm gonna take another blending brush. Um, I'm gonna use the Mikasa E300. So, I'm gonna just tap it into that same color. And I'm just gonna blend out what I already did with this brush. All right, so then I'm gonna go back with that um, Morphe E22. <laughs> Not dipping it in anything, whatever's left on it. And I'm just gonna go over everything again. All right, so now I am gonna use my um, MAC black brush. And I'm gonna take this color right here and pack it on the lid so I like to go close to the lash line because it's super pigmented and shimmery and I don't want it to get mixed in with my transition colors and my blend so I like to pack it low and then work my way up Uh, 
leg day. Okay. Next, I'm gonna take my NYC liquid liner that I love. And I am going to do a wing. All right, so it doesn't have to be perfect because with this look, I'm gonna make it smoky. So as long as you got a semi-wing up there, you're good to go. So <laughs> I'm gonna use my, uh, more and I'm gonna use this dark brown at the end. I'm gonna tap it in there. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over the wing I just did and almost pat it on top because I want this wing to look smoky. And then I'm going to go up into the crease. Keep it as low as you can and wiggle it in there. Like that. Okay, so I'm gonna go back to my um, blending brush, the one I used for the burnt orange, the Mikasa E300. I'm not gonna put anything extra on it, I'm just gonna use it to blend out down low because that's the one I used for my lower color. And I'm gonna blend all of it in. Course. I'm gonna go back in with my Morphe E22 and then I'm gonna go over all of it again up top. Okay. So I'm gonna take whatever's left on the lid brush and I'm gonna lightly clean it up and add a little bit more to the front and the middle. All right, so then once you do that, sometimes, you know, the shimmer will get mixed into what you already did. I'm gonna use that same pencil brush that I did the darker color to make the wing look smoky and I'm gonna lightly just clean it up with it. All right, like that. So now I'm gonna take Um, this eyeliner to I get my waterline up. Alright, so now I'm gonna curl my lashes with this horrible lash curler that I have. I need to get a new one. I like to put it up there and then sort of pump it a couple of times. Anywho, it's a horrible one. And then I'm gonna use my, then I'm gonna coat my lashes with the L'Oreal. I'm going to do my bottom, my lash line. Okay, so I'm gonna take a different pencil brush and I'm gonna use the Morphe M169. And I'm gonna go in with this lightest color top. I'm gonna tap it in there and I'm going to just blend it all over my lash line on the bottom. 
All right, then I'm gonna use the raw. Anyways, this one right here. A little bit of both of these. Cause why not use everything in there? And then I go more towards the end and I'm gonna wiggle that in there. And then whatever's left on the brush, I'm gonna dust it towards the front. Voila. All right, so now I'm take a liner take brush. And then I'm gonna go into this dark brown color again. Mm. So I'm mainly gonna get it in the corner of my eye, the lash line. And then when you get towards the front, get as close to your waterline as you can and lightly pat it in there because you want it to be super thin at the front where I do. And then I like it a little thicker and darker at the end to make your eyes pop. And then I'm gonna go into that wing with this brush. And I'm almost relining the wing with this brown eyeshadow and this brush. And then I like to take it on top of the wing and flick up. All right, like that. So now I'm gonna use my um, Rimmel and I I'm eyeliner. Going to put that in my waterline. Like that. Okay, so then I'm gonna use. Um, anyways, I'm using these lashes. I want to say they're by. Adele. Okay, so now I'm gonna take just um, almost like a lip brush. This one, of course, I got it from Michaels. And I'm going to go back into that color right here that I put all over my lid. I'm gonna dip it in that. And I am going to go in the bottom and almost in my tear ducts with this color. And I'm gonna drag it a little bit under where I did that dark. Focus most of the color right here. Mm -hmm. And then try to make it like fade. Like so. All right, so now I am just gonna take um, mascara and coat my bottom lash. Like that, and voila. All right, so that's your final look. And this eyeshadow look by Anastasia. Oh no, wait, by me. <laughs> Anywho, I hope you liked it. Just wanted to do something quick for you guys because I've been working like a slave. So, anyways, if there's any kind of looks that you would like or give me an idea of what I should do next, comment down below. Um, I'll leave everything that I put on my face today uh, in the description. Do right. Do damn right.